With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone. So the question is time taken by a 836 watt heater to heat 1 liter of water from 10 degree centigrade to 40 degree centigrade is. We have to find out the time taken by the heater to heat 1 liter of water from 10 degree centigrade to 40 degree centigrade. Now the power of heater is given that is given as P equals to 836 watt. Now the heat taken from this heater can be written as that is H taken so heat taken from heater can be written as power into time and power is given so it is 836 into time this is the heat taken from the heater now water used same amount of heat to change its temperature from 10 degree centigrade to 40 degree centigrade so i can write that heat used by water that is suppose delta q delta q is the heat used by water to change its temperature and that is equals to m s delta t now the mass of the water is given as one liter and i can write this as one kilogram this is liter sorry one liter and i can write one liter as one kilogram so one liter equals to one kilogram and temperature difference is also given which is from 10 to 40 so i can write 40 minus 10 that is 30 degree centigrade and s is the specific heat capacity of water and the value of specific heat capacity for water is 4180 joule per kilogram per degree centigrade now putting all the values we will have delta q equals to suppose this is my equation one delta q equals to one into 4180 into 30 this is suppose my equation 2 now from the principle of calorimetry we know there is no heat loss no heat gain heat released is equals to the heat absorbed so i can write equation 1 is equals to equation 2 because equation 1 is one of heat taken from the heater and the same amount of heat is used by the water to increase its temperature so both the heat are equal so i can write 836 into t and that is equals to delta q which is 1 into 4180 into 30 now from here the time can be written as 4180 into 30 upon 836 after simplifying this i have the value of t that is coming out to be 150 second so this is the answer which is 150 seconds so check the options the third option which is 150 second is our right answer okay thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today